Me thanks. New at six, the city of South Bend warning homeowners of an ongoing problem: stolen garbage containers. Now the city estimates at least six bins are stolen every day. WSBT 22's Annie Chang has been looking into this, and Annie, it's not the city footing the bill for these. South Bend used to pay for the replacements, Rick, running the city about 150 grand a year. But because of the increase in thefts, homeowners now have to pay $50 to replace their own stolen containers. Now, just yesterday, police found more than 20 stolen trash bins at one property, and that's not all they found. It started when a neighbor called the city's 311 line. Uh, we got a call from an area resident. Uh, they called in and stated that they had their container stolen. Neighbors led city workers and police to this vacant home and garage on the 1600 block of Kendall Street. Mackenzie Fantetti, whose family lives behind the alley and whose bin was also stolen, describes what they found. Like I look back there another day and there's like 20 trash cans back there. 21 cans to be exact, plus an illegal dumping site. People were just throwing like tons and tons of trash and like everybody was throwing trash. There's all kinds of uh, um, refuse, uh, lumber. Uh, it looks like mostly people's trash. Um, maybe they're not paying for trash service and have threw their trash in here. When the city finds vacant houses being used as dump sites like this one, it calls in a contractor for emergency boarding. Every board up costs $75 of taxpayer money, but prevents more dumping. We have, like, animals, so, I mean, if animals were to get in that trash, I mean, that's kind of upsetting. I actually care a lot about my animals. As for stealing trash bins, that's also a crime. Technically, can be charged with uh, criminal conversion, uh, okay. which would be a misdemeanor. The city says it's putting tracking devices on all the garbage bins so workers can look up their locations. That whole process should be wrapped up in six months. In the meantime, though, police say it's a good idea to write down the serial number on your trash can in case it disappears. That could make it easier for police to find it. Now, if you do suspect your bin is stolen, call 311. In the studio, I'm Annie Chang, WSBT 22 News.